You may have seen some news about a space hurricane swirling around social media over the weekend. It's actually something that happened back in 2014. So the question, of course, is why is it coming to light now? Well, meteorologist Ryan Breton is here with the answer to that and more. Hi, Ryan. Hey, Sharon. Obviously, hurricanes here on Earth, known for their counterclockwise swirl with bands of heavy rain and wind spiraling around the eye. Weather also occurs in space. It's not precipitation, but streams of charged particles driven by the sun and carried through the solar system by what's called the solar wind. Well, researchers are calling the space hurricane. That's a new one, though. It was discovered by astronomers from a few countries, including the U.S., looking back through satellite data from August of 2014. Now, this was invisible to the naked eye as it wasn't raining precipitation. It was raining electrons into the very highest levels of our atmosphere. And this is an illustration using satellite data showing the swirl. It was 125 miles above the North Pole, 600 miles wide, lasting for almost eight hours. It obviously looks like a hurricane with flows in a counterclockwise clockwise motion around what looks like an eye in the middle. The researchers believe the incoming solar wind carrying plasma and the magnetic field over the North Pole created this interaction. So what does it mean for us? Not much. Our weather happens in the lower atmosphere. However, space weather can impact satellites, GPS, or radio communication systems, which is why research is always ongoing to learn more about it. I'm meteorologist Ryan Breton. New Center, Maine.